you have to do it in the woods hey guys you're welcome back to my channel this is your girl favor favor of Alize. and um, if this is your first time of seeing my face or any of my videos please feel free to subscribe and um, hit the notification bell to get notifications whenever i post new videos and to my returning subscribers thank you for always coming back to watch and if you've been watching my videos and you've not subscribed i appreciate your effort of watching the videos but just go the extra mile by you know subscribing you know those subscribe counts I'll be subscriber accounts they are really important and then i know that you will love this video i know i know inside my chest inside my hearts inside my heart of hearts that you love this video so please hit those like but those jesus hit the like button if you like this video i know you will like this video so let's just get right into the matter for today so today i'm going to be answering random questions concerning myself and yeah this is the period of vlogmas so yes i'm vlogging the mass okay so guys okay let's just dive right into this this episode you know <laughs> So like I said, I'm going to be answering random questions today and um, yeah, they are pretty random. I just found this random question tag somewhere and I felt, you know what, let me just do this because there are some of these informations if you don't know about me. They may seem little, but you know, just, just so you know your girl a little bit more. So let's just start. The first question says, do you sleep with your closet doors open or closed? <laughs> I sleep with my closet doors closed. Like everything has to be the way it is. Normally, I love my closet doors closed. So as I'm sleeping, it has to be closed. No brainer. So the second question says, do you take shampoo or conditioner bottles from hotels? Yes, I used to when I wasn't really on this whole uh, natural hair journey. But before I used to, because the hotel room has been paid for sure, why would I take it? I will take it. Your gear. <laughs> I will take it. Because, hey, just so. I just love those small, small packages. They, uh, what is it? Tubes. They come in. Just, you know, as a traveling, just throw it in there. But anyway, yes, that's the question. I'm, I, I, I do take it. But now that I do natural hair, I don't take it because... You know now you have to be careful what you put in your hair so the second the third question says do you sleep with your sheets tucked in or out i sleep with my sheets when you mean sheets how Sha, the bed i'm going to be sleeping on has to be really well laid there's this satisfaction i feel inside my heart when the bed is well laid and see the, the weird thing is I, I lay my bed and in the morning like anytime i lay my bed i feel very very like uncomfortable sitting on it because i feel like that little dent i don't like oh i don't like that dent. i just like the bed to be straight like that before i sleep i'll just look at it but mm -hmm, some people sound weird but i'm not weird i know i know i love it like that so sleep with bed, bed sheets or sheets tucked in of course they have to be tucked in because that is their normal place so the fourth question says have you ever stolen a street sign who would steal a street sign is that no madness? The fifth question says, do you cut out coupons and then never use them? Yes, I do. No, wait. Do I cut out? Okay, when it comes to online shopping, I I take coupons, but but at the end of the day, I think at, out of all the coupons I've, I've been taking and storing, and oh, I think I've only used one. <laughs> um, the next says, do you always smile for pictures? yes i do okay no basically i do so basically i do smile for pictures the next question says would you rather be attacked by a big bear or a swarm of bees i'd rather not be attacked at all i'd rather not be attacked why a big bear that will kill you swarm of bees at the end of the day kill the person i beg don't attack me at all at all <laughs> so the next question says um have you ever peed in the woods yes <sighs> <laughs> a lot of times a lot of times in the village sometimes we go for productions and um you're in a place where there's no toilets you know you have to do it in the woods <laughs> okay um do you still watch cartoons big time yes i still watch cartoons like hey <laughs> that's see 
when I was when I was doing my national youth service, my NYSC, I used to, people uh, used to be like, "Well, yeah, big age, you not watching cartoons." Blah, blah, blah. So my excuse was, tomorrow, someday, I will have children, and those children will want to watch cartoons. So I should be able to enjoy cartoons so that when they are watching the cartoons, I'm not irritated. But the, the truth of the matter is, that was not my reason. I just love cartoons. Till today, if you bring Cinderella, I will watch it and enjoy it. I will not feel like you wasted my time. See me if if you leave me by myself and I go to cinema, I will pay and watch and watch cartoon just by myself, not with my children, not with any kid. Uh, by myself alone, we can watch. Uh, there's this one I even want to watch, El Canto. I've not, I've not really had time this period. El Canto, I'm going to watch it. I'm going to watch it. Like I look forward to watching animations, cartoons. I love them. And we have drawn on that picture, on that same picture, on that question for long. So the next question says, um, where would you bury hidden treasures if you had some? Hmm. I've not really thought of that. I've not really thought of that. Where would I hide hidden treasures? Where would I hide, hide what treasures again? Where would I bury hidden treasures if I had them? I don't know. Deep ground somewhere and hide it. I mean, I don't know. Sha <laughs> what do you drink with dinner? Water. I drink water with dinner. What movies could you watch over and over again? Um, that war. Uh, hey, what is that? War Room. Yes, I I love that movie. War Room. I can watch Coming to America over and over again. That is the first one. I can watch um, Save the Last Dance over and over again. That's the first one. Over. See that Save the Last Dance. Eh, in my life, I've watched that movie more than. I don't even know. I, ca I cannot even keep count now. Like I've watched that movie countless times. So, War Room. I watched that movie like in a week. <laughs> I must watch the movie like twice before. But like for yeah, for like two years now, I've not watched the movie. But if you bring the movie again, I will watch it. I will watch it. Okay. So the next question says, um, do you ever count your steps when you walk? I do. And guess what? I took it a step further. I went and bought a watch for it. So that. <laughs> The watch will be telling me how many steps I took, you know. Okay, have you ever gotten a speeding ticket? No, we don't do speeding tickets here in Nigeria, but I don't speed too much because most of the times I can't, I'm, I'm with children, so yeah. Um, are you afraid of heights? Not really, I'm not really afraid of heights, but you get the height, so we will go rich. Please bring me down, and it's too close to. <laughs> It's too close to heaven and so far from the earth. <laughs> you get what I mean? Okay, so the next question says, is Christmas stressful? Oh, I love Christmas, but Christmas can be stressful. But I, I still love Christmas. I still love Christmas, but trust me, it can, it can be stressful. From the videos I've been posting for, for the past few days, now you should know that Christmas can be stressful. For me, at least. So the next question says, what are the occupations you wanted to be when you were a kid? I wanted to be a doctor, <laughs> a laughable idea. I wanted to be an engineer, laughable idea. I wanted to be a pharmacist, laughable idea. <laughs> See, I wanted to be all those, but I never wanted to be a lawyer. All those high, lofty careers to children, to us, because that was what um, parents always talked about. Uh, I, I wanted to be those, but seeing. You're calling now, you're calling. <laughs> At the end of the day, feel medicine, no. Feel like, the new one is saying no. Because, <laughs> me, put me inside that place with these, those, their cadaver. Me, I will faint. Me, by myself, I will faint. Or you say nothing. Mm -mm, I cannot behold nasty things. No, no. See, uh, some things, as, as a mother, some things still disgust me. Till today, some things are really disgusting to me. I do it, but I'm like, I can't believe I'm about to do this, but yeah, because things disgust me. And you now you now want me to be nuts. It's not going to work. It cannot work out. <laughs> okay, but yeah, I'm a teacher by profession and calling and all of that. Anyway, the next question says, um, do you believe in ghosts? Yes, I believe in the Holy Ghosts. That's the ghost I believe in. I believe in the Holy Ghost. Okay, so the next question says, 
um, the first concert you ever went to. The first concert I ever went to was a concert that I and my siblings, the Destiny Kids, um, performed, and I can't even really remember which it which it is at this point. It's been really long. So, um, can you curl your tongue? So this is the car. Uh -huh. ah, yeah, I can curl my tongue. Um, have you ever cried because you were so happy? Oh yes, I have cried because I was so happy. Countless times. Countless times. Can you swim well? <laughs> I believe you must have watched that um video of uh yeah, I, I that story time, yes, that story time video I put I made about um a dead person that drowned. I drowned, yeah, so <laughs> so I cannot swim well. That's uh I'm over that, but still after getting over it, I have not had a chance to learn to swim. So well can you knit a crochet? Yes, I can. I can knit a crochet. I can knit anything you see is knitting. I can knit it. I learned that when I was in JSS one. Um, are you a dog person? And guess what? There was, I I used to knit purses for people when I was in secondary school, my senior secondary school. I, was, I used to knit purses for people, like and I will not even sell it. I will just I actually can see eh. Oh, opportunity to make money. I was busy. The bonus in me had not kicked in. It has kicked in. <laughs> okay, so um, are you a dog person or a cat person? I am neither. I don't like pets. My husband loves dogs. He's still he's still talking of getting a dog someday, but like every time he says it, I'll be like, "Do you want the dog to die <laughs> of starvation?" Because I can only I don't like dogs. Somehow. Dogs don't like me. We don't like ourselves. Cats. Mm -mm. Basically, I don't like pets at all, at all. So that's it for this video. I believe you've enjoyed this video. Please make sure to like and um, subscribe and share. If you've not subscribed, please subscribe. Subscribe. Hit the notification bell to get notifications. And like this video. Give us a thumbs up because I know you enjoyed it. <laughs> okay, see, see you guys in my next video. Bye.